closures today as well, including schools and non-essential businesses. Leslie Van Arsdal is in Trenton to break down the new restrictions for you. Leslie. Hi, Yuki. Well, with the addition of 80 cases here in New Jersey, Governor Murphy is taking action. He's calling up the National Guard and setting up testing sites as soon as possible. On Monday, New Jersey's positive cases for COVID-19 jumped to 178. As of Sunday, the number was 98, prompting Governor Phil Murphy to take aggressive measures. Today, I am signing an executive order stating that effective Wednesday, March 18th, all New Jersey schools will be closed. And while this closure will be for at least two weeks, they will remain closed until such time as it is deemed by health officials to be safe for them to reopen. Governor Murphy is also closing all non-essential recreational and entertainment facilities and stopping short of a curfew, he's making a travel suggestion. All non-essential and non-emergency travel in New Jersey is strongly discouraged between the hours of 8 p.m. and 5 p.m. daily, effective this evening at 8 p.m. until further notice. Now, Yuki, as you had mentioned, all restaurants will be closed, allowing for takeout and delivery only. There's no timetable for when this will end, but the governor is asking for everyone to take this very, very seriously. Reporting live here in Trenton, Leslie Van Arsdal, CBS3 Eyewitness News. And Leslie, the new